Hi there. In this video I'm going to explain the difference between the minor and the cofactor of a 3x3 three three matrix. So firstly a minor of a 3x3 three three matrix. So let me take a red pen, ruler, underline this. Now supposing I have the 3x3 three three matrix, so I'll define that by the letter capital M. If that is defined by A11, A12, A13, A21, A22, A23, A31, A32, A33. Let me show you how we work out the minor. Okay? So supposing if I wanted to work out the minor of A11, say, okay, so minor of A11, here's the approach, okay? The minor is going to be the determinant, so it's going to be a determinant, okay? So when it comes to the 3x3 three three matrix, the minor of a 3x3 three three matrix is the determinant, okay? Whereby the elements of that determinant, so we're working out the elements of A11, and the elements of that determinant, and it's a 2x2 two two determinant, can be found by crossing or ignoring the row and the column associated with that element. So if I take two pens, if I ignore the row and the column associated with A11, so I'll take two pens just to see this, we're gonna have the elements A22, A23, A32 and A33. So these will be the elements of that 2x2 two two determinant. So A22, A23, A32, A33. Okay, so let's practice. So let's find the minor of, okay, let's say uh, A22. So we're going to be calculating the determinant of a 2x2 two two matrix. And the elements of that determinant can be found by ignoring the column and row of that element. So if I ignore the column and row containing A22, we're going to have A11, A13, A31, A33. Okay. Let's try another one. Okay, so let's try another one. Uh, let's work out the minor of A32. So minor of A32. So it's going to be the determinant of a 2x2 two two matrix. And the elements of that determinant can be found by ignoring the row and column associated by A32. So if I ignore the row and the column, we're going to have A11. A13, A21, A23. So those will be the elements of that determinant. Okay? So that is the minor, how to work out the minor of a 3x3 three three matrix. Okay? Now, cofactor. So cofactor of a 3x3 three three matrix. Now, with the cofactor, there is a subtle difference. The cofactor is the minor of that element together with the sign associated with that element. So, for 3x3 three three matrices, okay, so let me make a note. There are signs associated with the elements for a 3x3 three three matrix. So for the first row, the signs associated are plus, minus and plus. For the second row, it's minus, plus and minus. For the third row, it's plus, minus and plus. Okay? So the difference between cofactor and minor is that for the cofactor, it's the minor of the element together with the sign associated with that element. Okay? So if I take the same matrix M, and just as an example, 
if I were to write the cofactor of A11. So firstly, the sign associated with A11 is plus, okay, as you can see. And then you write down the minor of A11. So then write down the determinant of the two by two whose elements can be found by ignoring the row and the column uh, involving A11. So if I ignore the row and the column, I'm gonna have A22, A23, A32, A33. So that's the cofactor of A11. Let's take another example. Cofactor of, let's say, um, A21. So the sign associated with A21 is minus. And now we need the minor of A21. So that's the determinant of a two by two matrix. So if I ignore the row and the column involving A21, the elements of that determinant are A12, A13, A32, A33. Okay, so that is the cofactor of A21. Okay, just one more. Let's work out the cofactor of, let's say, A33. So cofactor of A33. Sign associated with A33 is plus. And let's work out the minor. So it's the determinant of a two by two matrix. Ignoring the row and the column associated with A33, the elements of that determinant are A11, A12, A21, A22. Okay. So that ends the video on cofactor and minor. So I hope you understand the differences between the two or the difference between the two. Okay. Um, and yes, that ends this video also. So I hope you enjoyed this video.